Imagine an invisible force so destructive it wreaks havoc on every cell it encounters. This is radiation, the silent assassin lurking in our environment. When it strikes, it's like a wildfire through dry forest, annihilating everything in its path. Picture your body as a bustling city where each organ plays a crucial role. Now envision radiation as a relentless storm tearing through this city, leaving chaos and destruction. The most devastated area, the gastrointestinal tract, our body's nutrient powerhouse becomes ground zero. Here, radiation doesn't just damage, it obliterates, killing cells indiscriminately, disrupting the delicate balance of life within us. This isn't science fiction. It's a grim reality for those exposed to high radiation levels. But what if I told you there's a glimmer of hope amidst this devastation, a way to shield our most vulnerable organ and fight back against this invisible enemy? All right, folks, strap in because what I'm about to reveal didn't just land in our laps. It was unearthed like a rare diamond in the rough. Imagine a world-class team of scientists battling against time, wading through uncertainty, and facing the unknown head-on, all in the quest for answers. This wasn't your average day at the lab. It was a Herculean effort, filled with late nights, countless experiments, and yes, real sacrifice. They were on a mission to crack a code so complex it could very well be the key to our survival against radiation's wrath. And guess what? They did it. They've penned the majestic paper titled, Multi-Omics Analyses of Radiation Survivors Identify Radioprotective Microbes and Metabolites, which is a testament to human resilience and ingenuity that could very well redefine how we combat one of our greatest foes, radiation. Picture this, a team of scientists, not just any team, but a coalition of the brightest minds from the University of North Carolina and Duke University, led by luminaries like Hao Guo, Wei Chun Chu, and the visionary Jenny P. Y. Ting. They didn't just write a paper, they penned a manifesto of survival against all odds. Picture the scene. After a devastating radiation event where you'd expect no life to withstand the onslaught, a group of elite survivors emerges, not just surviving, but thriving. The burning question, what incredible power did they harbor within? The answer, hidden within their guts, is as astonishing as it is promising. These elite survivors, a group of seemingly ordinary mice, carried within them not just any bacteria, but warriors of the microbial realm, true champions in the face of adversity. Our intrepid researchers uncovered that two species of bacteria, Lachnosporache and Enterococcaceae, were not merely surviving. They were thriving, forming a shield against radiation's wrath. But that's not all. They also found that, that these two bacterial species were also found in higher abundance in leukemia patients undergoing radiotherapy, a beacon of light in the shadow of radiation. But why are these microbial marvels so special? These microbial gladiators do more than just stand their ground. They do two main things, boosting the production of new blood cells, a process called hematopoiesis, and helping repair the gut, which is often hit hard by radiation. The scientists then did something incredible. They took these two special bacteria from some of the super-strong mice who could survive high levels of radiation and transferred them into other mice. It's like giving these new mice a superhero shield against radiation. The result? An amazing 75% of these mice with the special bacteria survived intense radiation. A huge jump compared to only 20% survival in mice without this advantage. But wait, the plot thickens. These super mice? the ones that shrugged off radiation like superheroes, had a hidden ace up their sleeves. Researchers found that their bodies were loaded with special substances called propionate and tryptophan metabolites. Think of them as their secret power boosters. Think of propionate as a superfood for our cells, especially after they've been hit by radiation. It helps repair our body and makes our cells strong again. Tryptophan, on the other hand, is like a soothing balm. It helps calm things down inside our body, reducing damage and helping with healing. Together, they're a dynamic duo, helping our body bounce back from the stress of radiation, making us healthier and more resilient. Ladies and gentlemen, gather around as we stand on the brink of a monumental leap forward in science and medicine. Imagine a world where the very fibers of our being can rise to protect us from the invisible dangers of radiation, a foe that has threatened human health and progress for decades. This isn't just science fiction. It's the dawn of a new era where our own bodies could harbor the secret soldiers in the battle against radiation damage. We're not just talking about a new drug or a temporary shield. We're talking about unlocking the human body's innate potential to fight back, to repair, and to thrive in environments that were once off-limits. Think of astronauts venturing deeper into space, shielded not just by suits and ships, but by their own cells. Consider the possibilities for cancer patients, receiving treatments with fewer side effects, or emergency responders, bravely facing nuclear accidents without fear. The journey to this point has been fueled by the tireless efforts of scientists who dared to dream big and work hard. Their dedication to unraveling the mysteries of the human body has brought us to the cusp of a revolution in healthcare and safety. This discovery is a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance, a reminder that within us lies not just the vulnerability to illness, but the power to conquer it. The adventure is far from over, and now you're part of the BioBite crew. 
Your mission, should you choose to accept it, involves diving headfirst into the uncharted territories of the comments section below. We're on a quest for knowledge, and your insights are the treasure we seek. Share your thoughts, unleash your curiosity, and let's navigate this microscopic universe side by side. But wait, there's more. Respond to our questions and join the ranks of explorers pushing the boundaries of science and discovery. And remember, stay curious, keep exploring, and join the BioBite team.